Kenny Berg. Kenny Berg. Kenny Berg. B E R G, like ice. Yeah, Berg. Kenny Berg. That's your Spotify name. Okay. Yeah. I just want to make sure everybody knows who's listening. Well, that's Scott here. You What's up, Kenny Berg? Berg. What up? How's it going on? There's, there is definitely a South African. Can I put these earphones on? Is that yeah, right? you can do that. For me, it's it's weird. I'd rather like to hear, hear it. People. What about you? I do too. Yeah. I'm doing it, but I've also at some point said maybe I don't need it, but I'm just going with it. But All you right. got bigger ones than I do, so. But it helps you listen. Yeah. It gives you like a little bit of echo, but it's oh, fine. It's a bit Whatever. Weird, actually. Yeah. As long as you can hear him so for me, physically, you know. Yeah, yeah, I'll leave it. I'll leave it right? I'm gonna do it just for okay. whatever. When I move to this city, these things aren't that if bad. If I could tell you a bit about me. Yeah, I want to hear it. I want to hear your in, musical in, background in Dundee, and all that. Musically, this is this is me musically in Dundee. Where is Dundee? It's the east end Scotland. of Scotland. Oh Jesus! Yeah. Scotland, as this Scotland. fucking guy would bastardize it. it. No, I'm sorry. I apologize. You're from Scotland. Please, Please, I'm sorry. Let me before we go on. I'm sorry. Family from Scotland. Can we just introduce him since oh, sorry, no yeah. one's gonna know who the yeah. fuck this guy is? So my <laughs> name's Dylan, and uh, I'm from South Africa. South Africa. South South Africa. South Africa. Yeah, I'm sorry. You have to say it as fast as you can if you want to have that. South Africa. No, no, I'm from, so South, the, I'm no, from no. South Africa. No pressure. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's where I come from. Um, I've got an Irish passport. Which is good for me. Is it? Cool. Uh, the South African passport is a load of shit. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Just lucky for me, I've got an Irish passport. Yes. Family's yes. from, right. from Ireland. Are you really doing bars though? Um, the Netherlands. You're a sexy you barman. Speak. You okay? I'm good for now. Yes, right. thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I can't Appreciate wait till somebody fucks you. I'm going to be up in their face too. That's what I'm waiting for, man. <laughs> me too. <All> day. <laughs> but yeah, brought up in uh, South Africa. And. Um, Taught, taught, I'm a school teacher, so uh, yeah, taught in South Africa, taught in Saudi Arabia. What do you years. teach, by the way? Like primary school, primary, 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 yeah. Family school. What do you mean, like primary, 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 primary? Yeah. So I'm an American. Kindergarten. Kindergarten. Uh, I speak no. American. <clears throat> Above kindergarten, before normal yeah. school. Yeah, yeah, what yeah. What would you call in America? Prim- uh, kindergarten, right? Kindergarten yeah, but, kids, no, but isn't it? Kindergarten elementary, here. elementary, elementary school. Yeah, yeah, elementary, yeah. yeah. That's the next thing above that. Elementary, yeah. Watson. Elementary, Watson. <laughs> that reminds me of the best joke. Okay, <laughs> there was a moment in fucking British history that they decided to uh, quantify the best joke that ever got told in English. Yeah. And this is it. So, Holmes and Watson are sitting camping. And and Watson looks up at the stars like, hey man, do you know, Holmes, that this star has, if you look at it, maybe it's dead, maybe maybe that died 10,000 years ago, but the light that comes from that star could never, could never hit our tent in time for us to see it. Maybe it hits it in 20 fucking thousand years. And, and Holmes is like, huh. Somebody stole our tent, Watson. <laughs> I was already getting. That is, yeah, yeah. I know. But that's the funniest joke that ever got told in the English language. Dude, it's fucking America. hilarious. Somebody stole our and tent. And that reminds me, we, we we need to have a talk about that. As far as physics and in astrophysics, I'm you know, a big. Let me, let me I sober. love yeah, no. yeah, it. We won't do it right we now. Good chat about it. We'll yeah, we will. Well, we'll that'll be another podcast. podcast. It's more about. Well, we should do it. But to be fair, I'm into it. The chat we had earlier was more about um, what we think might happen and and how much we can't know what is going to happen because of new inventions like Neuralink. Like yeah, if we never know. And people you never that know. don't know about Neuralink that are going to be scared about it. it, it for me, it's like... I get the fear, so let's, 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 let's know, let me be devil's advocate. I'm on your side. Play I'm on, I love playing devil's advocate. I am on your side, so let's just... I am on any side. But I can understand why somebody wouldn't want to get a fucking quarter drilled into their skull. To, but I mean, that's irrational. This that's rationally, like, this I'll is, do it. If they ask me, I'll once, fucking tomorrow, I'll do it. Once a million people get that thing... 
It's going to be Yeah, normal. we can't even get a million people to get a fucking vaccine. There's four million that got for it here, bro. For fuck's sake. And you're talking about drilling a... There's nerd. four million people that got it in this I know. It's already. not going to happen. Not... It I mean, will, maybe... Bro. No. Well, it will in like 150 you years. So, so neuro, Yeah, he'll, I'll, I'll let him... Make, me and him when we first met each other. I know, I know all about this, and I get yeah, it. Yeah, we were talking yeah. about uh, Neuralink. Elon Musk. Elon Neuralink. Musk. How yeah, that man. Yeah, I, how I own a Tesla. The I'm all about that man has changed the planet to the nth degree. What Nobody can. Man? Thank you so much. So uh, uh, Elon Musk went to the same university that I went to. Oh really? Yeah. The yeah, he's uh, from South Africa. Oh, South Africa. Oh, South Africa. oh yeah. duh! The only difference between uh, Elon Musk and myself is I actually got a degree from the university. He and did. He did yeah. <laughs> what uh, a wanker! Oh, yeah, what a wanker! Yeah. There, there's a there's a there's a bigger difference that yeah, we want to talk. Yeah, there's a big yeah. got your degree. Yeah. This man changed yeah, yeah. the world. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Look, yeah, yeah. so many people. <laughs> So no, many no, people no, no, no. don't like him for 100%. weird reasons. Hundred percent. Just a just a bit of a joke there, but it's a great yeah, joke. So we went to the same university, so Pretoria. My my father is actually from Pretoria. I lived in Pretoria for five years of my life, where Elon Musk is from. And um, yeah, dude, a fucking what a crazy dude. What no, a crazy, like, crazy fucking. Crazy, dude. But you want crazy. crazy. There has never been <coughs> another. Not crazy. this is this is this is true. There's never been Crazy another dude. human that has done more for the world than he has done. Well, I there is never. Yeah, go, go and mention me one, and I will fucking tell you how. Mahatma Gandhi. Me. No, I'm just saying. Yeah. What? Maybe. 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 Fucking no. There's an argument. But we're in a different world. We're in a different yes. world well, than Mahatma Gandhi. Yes, but not actually <laughs> change the world. Yeah. He changed a couple of people. Yeah, dude. He and, uh, didn't change the, the scary world. thing about him is, I think, um, I think he's there's a lot stop. more to be he's changed. Not he's he's, he's not just stop. the beginning stages. Yeah, he's. And, uh, and I'm so sad no. that that man. We're talking not about everything for a million years. Yeah, dude. We uh, good. We don't need talk. you anymore. You can crazy just talk crazy, crazy things, man. Crazy things. Yeah. No, I agree. Crazy, in crazy, crazy. To me, I think Elon Musk is one of the most amazing human beings in the world. I get it. There are people that they, and and but there be rightfully more people like this, uh, right? But there there are people, people like that have this. gripes about him. That they're, 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 everybody's like, oh, they anti will, but, Elon Musk. I'm like, fucking come on. You How could you be anti that guy? I mean, because like, he, he, but there is. Yeah, there of is. course there is. Because. And they always sure. will be. They always will be. And, yeah. and they may have a they may have a a point. I get it. Okay. But push it, we uh, need those kind of people to move forward in society. Right. It's very plain and simple. So Everyone else needs to just shut the fuck up. Yeah, man. And that dude is suck doing it. shit. You know what yeah. I mean? Like he's doing some crazy shit. He's, he's not coming to your house and shit. fucking like murdering you. Times. Like yeah. he's not. Yeah. He's, he's doing just any harm, yeah. pushing the fucking world forward, and we need to because have to no one else is thinking about that shit. Ethics. Yeah, man, crazy dude. And progression. We have to get in, like yeah. ethics and progression. Yeah. They're 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 so fucking intertwined that as a as a normal human, you either have to embrace or shun. Yeah. Right. That is it. That is it. You can either embrace the progression of what the fuck humans are doing, or you can shun it. Yeah. Yeah. And if you shun it, you're basically, for me, as an opinion, you are, like I told you earlier, you're the, the religion that stops yeah. science. Exactly. Oh, yeah. So ethics is the new religion that's going to stop science. Or, or fucking. Again, though, I, I agree with you pretty much most of that but again what, what I would have to say though you have to include ethics in everything in the example I gave you going back to Elon Musk you know? yes because when you program let's say a car well, like a Tesla so that's agreeable to it. hang on let me finish sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah, no, no, it's fine I, do I get it. I do it I do it too I do it. I no hey, worries no I'm not gonna get offended because I do the same thing <laughs> So don't smack me yeah, you when want I to yeah. something. Yeah. No, I I'd love to hear it. But when you're when you design a let's say a self-driving car, mm -hmm. at some point somebody has to design the ethics of or the morality of the car. Yeah. Is that car going to decide to save your life? 
or the family that's on the side of the road, who gets to decide, oh wait, save the driver, but kill all the family, or save the family, but you die? Well, like, I think at who, the end of the day, it's who like, does uh, that? Elon answer. Musk? Is it not the perfect answer to that quandary? I think we'll I don't never, know. you'll never be able to, but is it not to the save everybody, but, but at the same time, if there is somebody trying, you know, like trying to protect people like he is, you know, like the self-driving car and like, that, that thing that. fucking steers for you, goes off the lane, it diverts straight for so, so he's trying something, you know what I mean? I don't but know at some point there has to be a decision Atomos. made in the software yeah, that dude. decides yeah. one or the other. I mean, you, automatic can, braking you can split the hairs as much as you want. Yeah. But at the end, you have to make a decision, driver or the... Yeah, you got to choose. Who's going to... Who's going to... Yeah, yeah. It's going to be the company. He's taking yeah, yeah. It's, it's going to be wild. He's got when a big ball sack when, he, yeah. when it comes to lawyers and things like that. Yeah, the decision you better be on, ready for that right? shit. Yeah, you better be ready. You better be you ready. Think that he's Luckily, he's a South African because they made a steal. Eh? Exactly. South Africans are made a steal. Sure, they are. Bring it on. Let's go. I have just found that out. There we go, man. Yeah, Jeez, South yeah. Africans are. I think are he's tough. taking in Asimov's rules for. Robotics. Dude, I think that guy. He has. He, he has yeah, to, he's, he's have to have wrote, read Isaac Asimov's. Oh no! Of course, dude, course he that has. Guy's read he a lot has of shit. Have. Dude, yeah, he's dude. a smart guy, and I I do trust his, Elon his, Musk his to do it all. Thing for the human race is he wants dude, to he's landing fuck. fucking rockets yeah, off places. He's already as considered well the concern. Well, How do I get? He has changed the human race for. Forever. Yeah, forever, and I'm dude. down with that. One person. Imagine that, a company, that right? Be, that has to be so inspirational for every other motherfucker in the world to think that as a one man, you can, if you if you're good enough, you can change the fucking. Dude, world. you imagine like a think about it. You saying, once, dude, we want uh, as a person, I want to make. There's a really good song from a Scottish band called Admiral Fallow. It's called Oi. Tiny Changes to the World. Tiny Changes to Earth. I heard of that. And if you make tiny changes to Earth in a positive thing, yeah, you're raising a vibration. And that sounds so fucking whatever, but you're you're making this world a better place. That is, yeah, the, that is stripping it down to this basic fucking form. Yeah, Mate, I want to do the smallest do changes good, yeah. to Earth. I want to make... Like through my music, through my things that I do, I just want to make something a little better. I could never, I, I think me, I could never be there. <laughs> I could be. If I only believe Dude, I that think, I, uh, be. I think, I think, I think a lot of this, what we're talking about, comes down to where you come from, what you've experienced in life, what you want to be in life. You know, it's easy for people to turn around and, you know, we just go with the flow and whatever life brings our way we just get on with it but people like that are different they're different they want to change things you know it's easy i think the easy way out is uh Believe you know you can. yeah it, i mean i what think I'm this is a perfect say, example the easy we, way out we've is, never met each other until true, yeah. like we just walked up in a bar in budapest from different places yeah yeah we're here doing a podcast Mag, and we're talking crazy, yeah. stuff yeah, of course. And and that goes exactly what you yeah, were going to say. Of course. It's beautiful. You, you could just go with it or you could step out. I mean, even I'm us just sitting in front of a and podcast and just talking shit. Myself if I don't. No problem. You'll, get to You'll be mind. back. You'll be uh, back. We know that. See you later. <laughs> yeah, it's true, man. We're just stepping out of uh, our comfort zone and just talking to each other. Exactly. Having a good time. We and never had a pro. We never talked about what we're going to talk about. Exactly. Yeah. You just sat know, down yeah. and... My name is Dylan. Yeah, yeah, Tim. Tim, yeah, there we go. Tim. Exactly, Tim. You're from South Africa, I guess. South Africa. Yeah, You're from Atlanta, Atlanta, Georgia. Orlando, Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia, oh, yeah. Atlanta, Georgia. Okay, yeah, cool. but I mean... I've seen it in movies. Never be there. Or... Yeah, yeah. Oh, there we go. That's why I'm here, ironically. But, I mean, it's amazing. And That's I think amazing. what amazing. I love about podcasting is that... You can just sit out and talk about whatever the fuck you want. We didn't have a topic when we got here. Yeah, we just we didn't. In, we People sit down. Who wants to talk? We Let's talk, yeah, yeah, yeah. and we get into things, you know. And you're from, you know, South Africa, and I'm from Atlanta, Georgia, and we have yeah. all these experiences. Yeah, yeah. Somehow, you and I are now sitting next to each other. Exactly, man. It's sick. <laughs> so it's sick. Dope, yeah, it's right? crazy, right? Can you not? 
<laughs> fucking love that. I mean, yeah, here we cool. are. It's cool. Yeah, it here is. We are. And yeah. I mean, no, it's a, it's why a not? fucking experience. Here we are. Yeah. It's better than radio. Yeah. Better than TV. Better than anything. Yeah. You know? And here we are. You doing your thing. I mean, you, and so what are you doing? You just haven't, I mean, maybe I did. I'm yeah, sorry. so I'm a school teacher. and uh, You did say this earlier, but yeah, yeah I want to hear it again, please. But, um, cause I have to yeah, so I started a few businesses in my life. What? So you teach school teaching, what age group do you do? I do primary school, so American would be elementary, elementary school. What, what tell me, I know. So, Fuck okay, so I'm, I'm, I'm an old best. man, I don't know. That's okay, yeah. I don't know what, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> nowadays <laughs> things change so much, so like, age, yeah. age so, groups. I'm at, okay, I'll explain it to you. I'm at a, a Hungarian, well, it's not an international school, but it's a bilingual school. Do you speak, so you speak in Hungarian? No, not at all. Okay. I speak Dutch. Though, like okay. Afrikaans, yeah. So I'm from South Africa, we speak Afrikaans, which is like a dialect of Dutch, basically. So I speak a bit of Dutch, but I've come to Budapest to teach English at a bilingual school. And How do you speak English, though? Like, so good. Like English so is my like family, immaculate. because I'm from South Africa, we come from different places. Of course, we're European. I'm a but you guy. were born speaking English. Like, yeah. So my family's. I'm Irish sorry. I'm a English. dumb. Okay. I'm a dumb American. I, we grew up speaking English. Mm-hmm. I'm like one of the few that speaks another language. I can speak Spanish. Oh, you can speak Spanish. Yeah, because. Okay. I used to love Spanish. Latin, wo- yeah. Latin wo- women, so I hey. moved to Mexico. Good man. And my uh, my wife is Dominican, so I'm okay. fluent in Spanish. But anyway, I didn't want to take away. Yeah, no, no, Please no. go ahead. No, so South Africa, um, we ha- actually have 11 official languages. So in South Africa, we have wow. 11 languages, yeah. One is sign language, which is pretty cool. One of the only countries in the world where... So do you, can you... Per- no, not necessarily. It's part do? of... No, no, no. Uh, no, I can't speak sign language, but it is an official language of our country. Um, so, but yeah, I speak. Uh, my family comes from from Europe, of course, Irish and England. The same. Yep. And um, yeah, South Africa has got people from all sorts. So, the roots come from the Dutch. The Dutch settled there in 1652, I believe. So a long time ago. And um, and in Manhattan. <laughs> yeah, so we've got the Dutch there. So, um, yeah, we speak a language called Afrikaans, which is pretty much which, Dutch. Um, why, why is... Okay, I, I don't mean to interrupt, because so I, I have to, like... No worries, yeah. Afrika- Every time I hear Afrikaans, I think of, like, it's from Africa. But it is, yeah, Dutch. so... Like, how it does is Dutch... Uh, Af- can you explain yeah, so that a little bit? Yeah, so in 1652, the Dutch settled in South Africa. Jan van Rubik arrived on a ship. Yes. And uh, they settled like a port 